In August 2016, I took an 8-hour trip 371 kilometers north of where I live to visit the famous Banawi Rice Terraces. Here's a plaque with information about it. Please just pause the video to read it. On my first afternoon, I visited four viewing stations where I can see the rice terraces. They were all not far from town, 30 minutes or so away. The spots were just minutes away from each other. I had interesting animal encounters outside each of them. Interestingly, the signs are all handmade. Hiwang Village is spot number one. It's a private resort type place. I believe there are cottages for rent. The place also sells carvings and wooden art. You can see the Cordilleras from here. And this is animal encounter number one. The second spot is called Viewpoint. Check out the charming handmade sign. Spotted this cool cat outside the exit. Drove past this DIY basketball stand that I just had to photograph. And this is spot number three. And there were a bunch of chickens outside. I stopped the tricycle to photograph this abandoned husk of a yellow car. Spot number 4 is called Main Viewpoint, different from the viewpoint of spot number 2. The view from here is really grand. This is the place I stayed at. It's on the main highway. On my second day, I went downtown. To get downtown, you walk to the end of the main road and turn left. You keep going, keep going. Basically, I came from up there where the yellow arrow was. Less than 5 minutes after turning left from the main road, you're downtown. You can also opt to walk down these stairs marked by my yellow arrow to get downtown. And this is downtown. There's a public market and a town hall and a ton of people because Saturday morning is market day for the people of Banawa and the surrounding areas. This was a pretty good green tangerine. Down these stairs, I think they're selling hides or pelts or dried meat jerky type products. Not sure. Could you make out what it was? Since it was hot out, I also got a halo halo, which is an ice dessert. They made it with evaporated non-dairy creamer instead of evaporated milk, which I normally prefer. Good for lactose intolerant people. Hey. 
had to stab it a bit as the crushed ice was quite solid. It wasn't finely shaved as they didn't have that fancy gadget that shaves ice into fine flakes. Still, it was pretty good. Here's a pair of formerly free-range chicken, now tied up behind a jeepney. You can see it breathing here. Here is another pair of formerly free-range chicken being tied up. I returned in the afternoon and shot the area after most of the shoppers have left to shoot clear footage of downtown. That's where you come from after going down the main road, and these are the three downtown streets. I went to the street with this yellow balcony and went to the restaurant across it. This is the view from the restaurant. That's the yellow balcony marker where I just came from and the street next to it, which leads up to the main road. And that's the public market to the left. This is the street you reach when you keep walking down the public market. On the third day, I took a one-hour tricycle tour to a town called Batad. It was quite far and rainy. Some of the roads weren't even paved. The entrance to town is marked by the end of paved road where all vehicles are parked. You hike down the scary elevated dirt path for 10 minutes before reaching narrow paved stairs that will bring you down to the actual town below, where people live. There is no other way down, not via motorcycle or 4x4. And this is the beautiful town. I shot these at one of the spots where I stopped to catch my breath. About 20 minutes in, you see a ticket booth. The farthest I got was this bench where I took this photo. You can keep going down to where you see the houses and walk on the actual rice paddies, but I gave up after hiking for an hour. You can even cross to the other side to see some famous waterfalls. Here are other photos from the trip. Downtown at night, tricycle with a Jewish star, two tricycles with worn USA flags, two dogs getting busy, some free-range chickens, and the view of the terraces from my hostel balcony. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please check out my blog for more photos. Link is in the YouTube caption.